Damn, guys, it's, it feels great to be back. Um, welcome. Uh, my name is Trickshot Holmes, and today uh, I have a, another story because, you know, apparently my channel does really well when I tell stories. Well, noticing off my last upload. Um, if you guys haven't watched it, link will be down in the description. Um, space. It was a story about me dropping a condom in class. And as much as I regret it, it was actually one of my better days. Um, yeah. So without further ado, I have another story for you guys today. This story, as you guys can see from the title, skunks. The skunks, no. I've I had one of the worst experiences the other day with uh, skunks. Um, now, what you guys don't know, skunks are, I'm going to be straight up and real with it, skunks are dicks, and they, they love, you know, they love spraying people, and no, I didn't get sprayed, sadly, kind of wanted to, but I didn't, I, uh, actually survived, yeah, I'm a survivor. You know, like Katniss Everdeen in the Hunger Games. I felt like, I felt like it was, I felt like the world was out to get me. Because you know, it was summertime, I'm sleeping in, right, right? And my mom wakes me up out of my sleep. Cause I, I normally don't wake up until about one o'clock in the afternoon. And then I wait until like six, seven o'clock at night to record just to get like the lighting and everything right and have no, you know, interruptions. And you know, it, it went pretty well. Uh, I recorded a video. Well, now, I'm recording the video that I'm supposedly giving off now. Uh, I recorded the video, you know, pretty well, pretty pretty good right about now. Uh, let's not get sniped. Okay, you got him. Oh no, 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 no. This is bad. This is bad. You don't think I see you? I see you. I see you. Okay, never mind. Uh, well, anyway, my mom woke me up at about like one. You know, she says, go, go get the trash, go take the trash out. And in the back, where it is, there's like this little small outhouse shed thing. I hate it. I hate it. Every time we have animals, I hate it. Because now we have a lock on it. I hate, I hate that lock. Only because I didn't get the combination right. And like the, tra the, the trash can that I grabbed, it, well, it was full, it was full, but it wasn't like all the way full. So like if it went, if it like, say it like moved a certain direction, it was gonna, it was gonna like tilt and whatever. Wow, oh, great. Uh, say like the bag tilted or whatever, whatever was in the bag was gonna fall over it. Okay, so I'm up there, I'm up there doing a lock, you know, minding my own, doing a little bit of freestyling, cause you know, I can rap. Um, hopefully that'll be showcased a little bit later on the, in the video or sometime next time in some kind of video but yeah i was out there freestyling and you know i was i was, I was making that i was making like the beast drop or whatever making sure everything like started flowing and making sure everything like sounded like legit because you know as as most people know that know me irl um i kind of idolize over eminem and this yeah i kind of over idolize eminem would not idolize, but like he's one of my like favorite rappers. One of my favorite rappers actually. But that's besides the point. Um, so she said she goes, go take out the trash. I'm like, but it skunks back there. She's like, yeah, I know, I know. Don't get sprayed because you're not coming back in the house. I'm like, okay, that's fair enough. So I'll call up, call up uh, zombie to come help me. She's like, no, I don't worry about them. You're doing it by yourself. I'm like, really? You really gonna make me do this? And she's like, yeah, go ahead. You're doing it by yourself because you want to sleep in like you pay bills around here. I'm like, okay, I see you, I see you. But if I get sprayed, you're the first one I'm coming to. No, I would never jeopardize my mom. She's too pretty. She's way too pretty. Uh, you know, but you know, I, I respect that. She says, you know, if you get sprayed by a skunk, don't bother coming back in the house. There's nobody wants to smell you. And you know, I thought I actually thought I smelled really good, and I and I didn't want to have to worry about everything. 
but that, that was not the case. Say I did get sprayed by this skunk. She was so serious. She was like, make sure you, make sure everybody, if you gotta deal with this garbage, pack a bag. And I will make sure, if you do get sprayed by this skunk, this bag will be sitting by the front door. You can open the door, grab the bag, and then sit outside back there with your family. The new family being the skunks. And I'm like, okay. So I have my bag or whatever pack or whatever, you know, you know. I pur I'm purposely sad about the door, like, yeah, I'm gonna get back there, I'm gonna get sprayed on purpose. The only time my heart has ever, you know, beat it that fast, because it, it kind of felt like my heart was going to explode. The only time my heart has ever be be beat, had, had ever beaten that fast was when I, I was dating my, my ex-girlfriend now. And we were, we were like making out or whatever. And, you know, stuff got, stuff got a little bit heated. I'm not going to go look too much into detail. Stuff got a little bit of heated, but you know, it was, it's all good. We, we, we controlled our teenage hormones for some weird reason. Because that's like a thing we know how to control, I guess. And, um, yeah. Only time my heart has ever beat that fast was that. The, you, you guys don't understand. The adrenaline rush that comes with dealing with skunks. It's like you're gonna die. And I felt like I was gonna die if I had got sprayed by the skunk. So, when, when it, whenever, whatever happened, when it happened, I dipped. I dipped like my life depended on it. And in a way, it did. Because, you know, say I did get sprayed by the skunk, I wouldn't be making this video right about now about skunks. I'd be in the back with, my, with, my, with like, Roy. Yeah, Roy. That's what we're going to call him. We're going to call him Roy. Roy, Miguel, and Bob. Because why not? Bob is a very... Not misused name, but it's one of the more... I've had this gravity spike for a while. Why am I not using this thing? Oh, never mind. To focus on the game. Right. Uh, yeah. Those, those, those guys, you know... They, they would have been, been my bread and butter, you know? She, she would have delivered me like a plate of food. And... It would have been like... She would have gave me a designated area to pick up the food. And you know, and like it would have been, it would have been like that. She gave me food, went back in the house, and went on with the day. But that's besides the point. So as I open the lock, I failed the first time. I go back at it again, you know. Failed a second time also. Go out it a third time. The bag rustles, and then it's quiet. Keep in mind, it's super quiet. Like you can hear, you can hear like a murder going on. And nobody, and everybody would know where you were. So you would be quickly located, you know. Not that much of a deal. But still, like, the fact that, um, I, I'm gonna lose on camera. But that, that doesn't matter. I, I don't care. Um, quickly wrap this thing up. Um, you know. So, everything that went down. The bag rustled. And I, I, see, we don't have a fence block in our area. Man. Our neighbors do. Both of our neighbors do. And it was like, I was like, it's, it's like this. I'm great. I'm last. It was like this. Imagine you, imagine having this bag. And this, I placed the skunk hole purpose. I placed the bag purposely next to the skunk hole. Only because I thought somebody, I thought it was skunks underneath where the, the shed. Where, where every the bag was placed or would not. I never ran so fast in my life. I thought I was gonna get shot at. And I thought somebody was out to get me. The bag like tipped over. All you hear is like it's crickly little. No, I, I can't. I, I don't have anything to use as an example. It's like this, the crickling of like a water bottle. And it like, it, it set in my mind like this is a skunk and he don't jeopardize your career. You need to, I didn't do bad thing. Anymore. You need to get this and get out of here. Um, yeah, but, uh, yeah, um, I quickly, you know, I hopped the fence, ran up, ran to, like, two houses over, hopped that fence, and then, you know, since I knew the house two neighbors over, you know, and I know the neighbors surrounding me, they was like, what did you just hop the fence for? Somebody else to get you, are you all right? No. Skunks. 
I was like, oh, okay. I politely went back the way I came. I uh, politely, you know, I backed the fence, went back to where I came from, which was my house. I'm gonna get sniped. I refuse to get sniped. Oh, that's even better. Um, but, uh, yeah, I, um, I politely went back the way I came, hopped both fences back, you know, careful not to step in any dog doo-doo, because that would be bad. I had my Jordans on. You know, I was, I was tiptoeing in my Jordans, so, you know, I wasn't more, more so tiptoeing. I was like, if I get caught with this, I'm going to get screwed. And, yeah, um, that's my experiences with skunks. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please remember to like, favorite, and subscribe for more content like this. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.